Yeah. Uh, so, my friend, this is uh, Dr. Igor uh, from Ukraine. Uh, yeah. So, could you uh, introduce a little bit about yourself and uh, why you join with this fasting and meditation group? And then, yeah, uh, like today, what do you feel? And uh, you see a such big group and you have a some movement. So, could you tell with our friends about it? Uh, well, myself, I was reading about Paul Bragg, the miracle of fasting, when I was just a teenager. It's been a long time ago, and then I was very excited about it, and I started fasting myself, just like once a week simply, which my parents were sort of a little bit cautious about, and then I started reading some other books about the most natural methods of uh, self-recovering and healing. And after 24 years in Vietnam, I have never met any person who talked about fasting, even though sometimes I was talking to people and say, you know, when you're sick, maybe you should fast for this one day. You will see the difference. And never I met a person who agreed to that until almost uh, a week ago when I met Madame Lee and she told me, oh, fasting. I was like, oh, you know, fasting. And she said, yes. I was fasting for the last 30 years. She told me about her experience and instantly we got connected and started talking and she knew Paul Breck and she knew uh, Malachov and all the other uh, famous people who did the fasting. It was amazing. And luckily because of her, I met Mr. Plot and his group and she brought me to this meditation and fasting group where I see huge number of people, about 40 people who do the fasting and meditation. It's such a big surprise to me because I have never seen such societies, not even in my travels in some countries in the world or in my own country. I know, right now, I know only one person who did fasting himself 21 days in Russia. But everyone thinks he's crazy. I know another person, she wants to do fasting, but she's afraid what people will think about her back in Ukraine. So people consider it something weird, where in Vietnam you see the whole communities who come to this naturopathic method of healing. And I think it's the most wonderful experience, because you can connect to nature. You can see these amazing people who have been fasting and have a fasting experience more than me. You can see how people connect to nature because, after all, we are the products of nature. We are yeah. the sons and daughters of nature. And you can feel it, experience it yourself, the most important connection to your truly self. I think it's amazing. Yeah. Okay, this this is amazing. So uh, today, uh, what do you, uh, what have you been doing, and what have you uh, learned about? Uh, yeah, up uh, t uh, today and during this course. Uh, I was very lucky today to meet Mr. Tuan, who is a, a teacher in Hanoi Medical University of Biophysics, and in his wonderful lecture, he also mentioned the people that whose books I read already, and then. We click on one person, he said, ah, he is my idol. And this person who was wearing the same shorts in summer and winter back in Ukraine. So we went swimming with him, even though the weather is a little bit of a winter, but water was not very cold. And it was wonderful to find such a friend who said, oh, let's go swimming. I was like, yes, let's go. I didn't think I would be doing it alone. And then uh, we learned about the most of the disease uh, come through the mouth and basically through the mouth can come the cure and then we did this wonderful meditation and circle and when you are connecting to the nature yourself it's one thing but when you do it in the group the energy the bliss the love the singing the connection is totally different so this is what you observe and you feel today. This is what I feel today. Yeah, that's great. And uh, you tell about, uh, you will tell your friends and maybe you will join the, the next retreat in Dalat. This yes. is what I want to do. Uh, number one, I already told my friends 
who lives in Ho Chi Minh City in the south about the Dalat next trip. I want them to come and experience because consequently they were talking about fasting and meditation and they said we cannot come up to north but if there are some of the retreats and I said oh there is one in Dalat and if I can clear my schedule I would love to do it again. Wow that's wonderful. Thank you very much. So uh, if you have uh, uh, something to say with the, the youth in Vietnam uh, 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 related to the fasting and meditation and they are searching about, uh, so what do you say? Uh, I have to say this that I always say to people. Don't believe it. If you, could, if you are not going to believe it, it's very good. Try it on yourself. If you don't believe, very good. Welcome. Try it on yourself and then only you can see, then only you can see the true results, whether it's true or not, whether it's working for you or not, what results it bring. Because if somebody tells you, you listen to and think, oh, I heard about it and one friend said this and another friend said that, it's always people around you or someone else telling you. Don't believe that. Do it yourself and then you know the truth. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Bye bye. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So this is uh, yeah what uh, Doctor Igor he tell about. Yeah, he uh, observed uh, today and also he really like uh, fasting and meditation. So if you would like to introduce a little bit about yourself and you've been practicing the meditation and fasting for almost uh, thirty years, and at the time you uh, already have uh, like uh, a single uh, dialogue with me about your, even your parents uh, did not agree with you. So this is a very important that in Vietnam also many people, they do, would like to do the fasting in a family, but their parents, their relatives uh, disagree. Yeah, so you might uh, would like to say something about yeah, that. That was uh, very interesting because it was actually my mom who knew that I like reading. She gave me the books about fasting first, and I read them. And I find them very logical. I find them very exciting. And I, and I decided, oh, I want to see how it works on myself. I'm a practical person. I want to try something out before I pass the information to some others. I want to have my own experience because nothing is more than your own experience. When you're talking to someone else, people will say, have you tried? And if you haven't tried, how can you convince them? So I started doing that. And then my parents were like, what the hell are you doing? And I was like, well, you give me this book? I read it. I found it intriguing. I found it interesting. So I want to try it myself. My parents were against it. But then they saw the results that I am actually healthy. That my study was so good. That my grades were up. That I was happy. That I actually did not lose much weight. I didn't look pale. There were no signs of weakness. Because people think, oh, if you don't eat food, how can you be healthy? You can actually be much healthier without food because food is not the only energy that we consume. There is air, there is sun that unfortunately all the people are afraid so much from brown skin. Brown skin is vitamin D. Vitamin D supports your immune system. That's why it is very important. So I started experimenting on myself, do combining it with Qigong, combining it with meditation and all the other methods. And the combination of methods is actually what brings even more results when you are fasting. So like, uh, yeah, um, today I um, um, thought uh, say I'm much about uh, connect with nature and uh, embrace the tree, the sun, yeah, uh, and uh, the forest path thing. So what do you think about our method? Uh, I think this method is quite a road to reconnect with in Russian, we call it the mother nature. It's a, it's a mother nature. And because it's a, it's a mother, which makes it our children. If you forget who you are, where you come from, then how can you have the road ahead of you? You have to be grateful that mother nature gave you birth. So you have to give something back. You should protect your mother so your own life as a child will be beneficial and successful firstly for you so the techniques the methods that you do for people to reconnect 
they are very easy. You don't have to practice very much. You don't have to have a knowledge. It's actually connecting to your nature is the easiest thing that can be done with the methods that you get the feeling today. Oh, that's nice. Wonderful. And uh, our friends, they really uh, curious about you, who you are and why you join with this uh, retreat because this retreat almost Vietnamese people, but like uh, international course with uh, you and also uh, would you tell a little bit about what are you doing in Vietnam? So that's very important. Thank you. Uh, I am in Vietnam for a long time and my main, uh, how can I say, point in the search is a combination research in a traditional Vietnamese medicine and see what benefits, what results it can bring to the world. How I can use traditional Vietnamese medicine, acupuncture, acupressure, meditation, qigong, herbs. How can I use it to make my patients, to make people around me healthy? So when I knew about it retreat, even though there were no foreigners, I still feel like Vietnam is my family. And I thought, oh, I'm going to reconnect to my family again in the modern nature, beautiful nature of Vietnam that we all should cherish and protect. That's why I chose it. Yeah, wonderful. So uh, since uh, you doctor, uh, you, you get doctor degree and think uh, how long you've been working in this field? I have been, well, for to be work, to talk about being working in this field, I started very young as a young practitioner, so experience maybe even more than 20 years. And yes, I studied traditional Vietnamese medicine in Vietnam, in Academy of Traditional Vietnamese Medicine. Wow. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, you said uh, this time you see uh, such a big group, uh, like more than 40 people, uh, right. to do the fasting at the same time. So this is uh, yeah, what you really amazed about. Yes. Uh, so uh, have you been, uh, have you ever seen uh, such big, uh, this big group in uh, Vietnam or like uh, in Russia or other countries that you've been uh, traveling? Unfortunately, I haven't seen a big fasting group. So I've seen some, I know a lot of people go on retreat. I know a lot of people become interested in meditation in a natural ways of healing themselves. I went on those few retreats myself, uh, but I've never seen a big fasting group. And I think it's very important because in my fasting experience, I know there are some days where you feel weak, when the slack kind of starts to come out, it makes you weaker, it makes you tired and you want to give up and that's why the support of the group is very very important where you see people around you maybe they're going through the same they can help you you can help them you can help each other unfortunately yours is the first group ever i've seen in vietnam or in some country that i have traveled around the world how many countries you've been traveling I've only been to around maybe 10, 15 countries, not mm. many. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank so, you. thank you. Thank you for your yeah. yeah, thank you. Yeah, các bạn, đây là anh uh, bác sĩ Igor, người uh, đã người người Ukraine. Uh, Ukraine và anh là có hơn 20 năm kinh nghiệm đã nghiên cứu các cái uh, thảo dược truyền thống của Việt Nam cũng như là phương pháp mà trị liệu truyền thống, cái phương pháp mà uh, châm cứu cũng như là cái um, y y học cổ truyền của Việt Nam và anh cũng đã tốt nghiệp uh, bác sĩ uh, và điều đó là điều rất là tuyệt vời và anh cũng đã tham gia cái khóa thanh lọc lần này cùng với thuật và hy vọng rằng chúng ta sẽ cùng với anh để uh, tiếp tục mà uh, uh, đồng hành ở cái khóa thanh lọc ở Đà Lạt và sau đó là đến Hứa rồi đến Đà Nẵng, Hội An và Vũng Tàu uh, sau đó thì uh, Hồ Chí Minh Xin cảm ơn tất cả và hẹn chào gặp lại. Hẹn gặp lại. Xin cảm ơn. Dạ, xin chào. Xin chào.